Craig, you seem to have a little bit of a spring in your step, the recovery going well. Yeah, flying to be fair, um, three months today, so that's good. Saw the uh, surgeon on Tuesday when I came back from a holiday and he's he's really happy with how it's going and said I can uh, start to up my rehab a bit now. Well, let's get right into it then and ask, with the fixtures being announced today, when are you looking to come back? What's your target? Uh, I'm not going to say out loud <laughs> when my target is because I think that'd be silly, but as soon as the fixtures came out, I'll text Davey, Davey my target and uh, I think it's, a, it's one where I'll push myself, but a realistic one at the same time. And you're heading into your second season with the club. Despite that injury, you can reflect very fondly on your first full season, can't you? Yeah, definitely. Um, I set targets of I wanted to score 10 goals and I was a bit disappointed I missed out by by one, but I got my eight assists I set, so I was happy with that. Um, so I want to come back and build on that. Um, when I come back from my injury, I don't want to just blend into the background. I want to come back and make an impact and turn heads and that's what's going to be motivating me and striving me forward. Of course it's a lot of hard work for yourself, there's not really been much time off has there, so you're back in now but you did get a little bit of time off, how was that? Yeah it was nice to get away with the missus, went to uh, Bali in Singapore which was lovely, so uh, a good break, uh, refresh my mind, refresh my body, still did all my rehab every morning so um, that was one condition that allowed me to go on on the holiday but it was good now so I'm excited to get back in, I was in probably Wednesday, Thursday and I'm being all week leading up to the lads coming back on Wednesday. And of course you'll be looking forward for that and as well with some of the new lads as well. It'll be good to see everyone bed in again, won't it? Yeah, definitely. I think it's good when uh, everyone goes to Dublin. It gives a, a week everyone together to build the build the connections all back up. And, you know, I've been missing the lads anyway and I've been speaking to them on regular. I went for a coffee with Tatey when he was back, so it was good. It's going to be good to catch up. Yeah, and what's the manager been saying to you boys throughout the close season? Obviously it will be encouraging that, that you don't, have any slacking that you do stay on top of things yeah definitely I think um, you don't want to come back chasing your fitness you always need to stay on top of it but at the same time you've played 50 games so it's important to rest your mind and that so it's the balance between it so probably now the lads will be uh, getting on the treadmills and putting the work in getting ready for Wednesday one of the good things as well is that there's not been many departures as well there's going to be a good bit of continuity going into the new season and certainly there's lots to build on as well yeah definitely I think when you have a squad like we've had um I think it's important that you keep us all together, you know, I think you can go in a lot of dressing rooms and you won't have that sort of balance and charisma and characters like we have where everyone gets along with everyone. So to keep that all together so far has been been a great, great step forward. Yeah, just on a final note, Craig, with the recovery stepping up with every day that passes, you must be feeling better and better and getting hungrier and hungrier. Yeah, definitely. Um, it's starting to be a bit light at the end of the tunnel. I mean, still, still a bit of a journey to go, but... Uh, I'll be making an everyday count now and uh, striving towards my target. Thanks, Craig. No worries at all.